Uh, so, so digital has uh, come to the forefront because of uh, the pandemic, as we all know. But again, it's been around for a lot longer than that. Uh, although now businesses have been uh, forced to fast track their evolution uh, uh, towards, uh, you know, transforming to digital channels uh, as a way of staying afloat. As we all know, you know, the econ economy came to a standstill. And um, the ones who stayed afloat are the ones who em embraced uh, digital marketing opportunities out there. There are so many opportunities uh, for someone in Uganda now, regardless of uh, the size of your business or whether you're a business or an individual or consultant. The mistake right now most uh, businesses do is they still have personal WhatsApp. So there are two versions of WhatsApp. There is WhatsApp for business, there is WhatsApp, the messenger application that suits, you know, personal conversation. So to a business out there, I would encourage them to uh, have WhatsApp business because it has so many tools that uh, it gives uh, a small business to take their product to market, but then also leverage uh, other channels uh, out there the Facebooks, the Twitters, the Instagrams, uh, they all have unique audiences there. They are relatively uh, in reach for so many. $5 gets you over 2,000, 2,500 people reached on these platforms. Uh, and you can easily create content uh, using either uh, someone or using uh, your mobile phone and so many other tools available to you. So the key thing for any business or the opportunity is if you are a business owner, you've got to talk about your business, you've got to showcase your products, you, you've got to showcase your uh, services. The beauty about digital and social media is the fact that everyone can play. So um, the lockdown and the results of it have a shrunk floor space for so many. So we know so many people, you know, had space in arcades and, you know, they have their merchandise back at home trying to figure out the next step. Uh, but now the floor space is not the question of the day. People are moving from floor space to cyberspace. And the cyberspace is accessible to everyone. There are a couple of uh, goods that are banned from being advertised, but these usually are, uh, you know, betting, uh, medicines and the like. But short of that, the ones that are not banned, anyone can play regardless of the business uh, or service that you offer. In terms of getting started, um, I would encourage two things. One is you need to, before you open up a platform or produce content, first understand what your product is and who your customer is. Businesses make a mistake of thinking that everyone is their customer. That is the ideal, but it's never the case. What we need to know when we are selling online is do not sell the product, but rather sell the benefit of that product to a potential customer. Because you see, there are so many guys out there who play in the space in which you play. So what you need is to create some kind of differentiator for your business. At NSSF, one of our deepest desires is for our members to have a better life. And we've been in a very, very turbulent environment. We'd like to rebuild together with you uh, and we're offering you these digital marketing tips so that you can leverage them and see your business stay afloat or you can leverage them if you're at home to actually jump back right into uh, the revenue generation market. And we're hoping that you tag along with us uh, on this journey. NSSF, a better life.